Hey y'all, thanks for stopping in. Uh, Alright. What is a fiddle toy? Well, I'm sitting here at the house. It could be a pair of needle nose pliers. It could be a clothespin. It could be one of these little clamps that I use for leather. Be a pair of scissors, another pair of clamps, pen, you know, and just like everybody else. I mean, I've been fidgeting since before we knew that it was a thing. Um, now, this is what I carry in my pocket as a fidget. These two are recent additions and I really like them. I did a video of me making this one. It's just hot glue and a skate wheel bearing. And then there's this one. Um, there's a bunch of these ring fidgets around. Usually they use a piece of a roller chain. This one I made out of leather. Again, the video is on my channel. Um, this is a sketchbook I made. This is actually a new sketchbook. I just made it because I go through these things quickly. Um, it, it, it really just it slips inside this little folder. So I'll probably do a video on how I make these one day. And then just to, <laughs> to double fidget because that pen... Anyway, yeah. Um, this little thingy. You know. A burgoo or burgero or whatever the heck it is. I don't know. It could it could be, you know, just worry beads. You can toss it. You can turn it. You can do this, that, the other thing. This is a combination. This one can be... You know, it can be, uh, it can be twirled. It's got the worry beads on it. It can be, you know, there's four on that side, and then there's four on this side, and you can pull it back and forth, and, you know, it's, um, uh, and if you don't want to do that, then you can just go and, you know, clip it and clip it. You know, it's a fidget toy. And then there's this, just another piece of leather. Actually, I carry... I either carry this, which is good, or this. It's just, I don't know, this is like a, a foot and a half, maybe, of paracord. Maybe two feet. Two and a half feet, I don't know. It doesn't matter. But, you know, you can do a chain stitch with it you're just sitting there you don't even have to watch you just you know this is this is a basic crochet crochet stitch but it comes in handy for all kinds of things and it's a very good fidget and then when you're done braiding it you pull it out or you know you double it up and you just make you know you do the same thing there and then you pull it out and you make anyway you just wrap it around your fingers and then pull it so you know fidget toys can be just about anything and everything that you fall upon um, literally just uh, yeah you know so Yeah, 
anything and everything. Like I said, though, these are the these are the ones that I carry every day in my pocket. I uh, I like this one. I can use this when I'm driving because I only need one hand to use it. It's um, it's not even perfectly round, and it doesn't spin. You know, like some of the like some of the folks out there, they're all obsessed about it. Oh, I can hit it and it spins for you know nine hours and fifteen seconds. And no, I'm not worried about that because I'm not sitting there staring at it. That, that's not what it's for. It's to keep my hands occupied. Same with this one. I can use this one while I'm driving, while I'm sitting watching TV. You know, some of these other ones. This is for when you're sitting somewhere, like watching a, a grandkid play t-ball. Same with that. Um, or these. This is when you're sitting, waiting for somebody to come out of the store that was only supposed to take, you know, two minutes, and they've been in there for three hours. Um, and it's just a small one. I mean, I've got, I've got sketchbooks all over the place. Anyway, uh, thank you all for stopping in. I appreciate you taking your time to uh, see what I'm up to. If you take another second or so and click that like button, it would help. Um, so, yeah, yeah, until the next time or whatever, then thank you and uh, goodbye.